hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is fazati ali and i'm an interior designer who's always giving the best tips on how to make your space look stunning i also do diys and give you guys affordable ideas on how to make your own home deco pieces i also paint so do feel free to hit that subscribe button below and join the family i upload videos every single week also don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you can always be alerted every single time i upload a new video anyway guys let's get straight into today's video as i show you guys how i got to make this beautiful um vase just out of towel and cement so another super easy super affordable diy for you guys i hope you'll enjoy it i can't wait to show you exactly how i got to do this and of course it will make your space look very very aesthetic so yeah let's get right into the video now the few materials you're going to need for this particular DIY is of course cement and I was able to get quite a lot of this because we just went um, with a couple of friends, bought a whole um, sack of cement slash bunia of cement and we were able to just you know cut the cost. So I got literally almost 14 kgs of cement for just around 100 and something shillings. Um, this here is a tool I'm going to use when mixing the cement with water right here um, Of course, you're going to need a stand where you'll put your towel over because this is what will um, Bring out the shape of your vase as it dries So I'm just going to use this spray paint bottles um, Of course, you're going to need a towel and I got this on the roadside just around 40 shillings and I think it's going to work just perfectly you can go for whatever size you want depending on the um, size of vase you want to create let's get straight into the project guys so we're we're pretty much done here so i'm just going to let this dry and from what i've seen um other people do they say it dries for um, about two or three days something of the sort so we're gonna give it probably two days to dry and then we're going to take it up here try to see if we'll paint it or spray paint it just make it look nice so i can't wait to see how it looks after it dries i love this um textures on the towel i didn't realize that i bought a towel with textures but i think this beautiful textures are going to look really good at the end of the day so yeah that, that easy guys just, just make sure your plates are lit <laughs> so guys it's actually been probably two days 
and it still looks wet but it's actually very hard literally it's really really hard so it's been probably two and a half days two days and i'm gonna try to get it I'm just gonna go with Basco value. It's for the wall and it's actually water based. Also, guys, it's just 150 shillings, super affordable, and I'm pretty sure it's going to work just fine. So guys, the, the white paint has pretty much dried, so this is what we have right now, it looks so good. So I'm just going to spray paint this silver because the theme in my space is just mostly silver and gold and all that, so I'm gonna go with silver, I think it's going to look good. to um sorry about the noise guys i'm kind of um outside at the door so there's a lot of cars passing anyway um now that i've sprayed this side i'm just going to let the spray paint settle um get to dry a little and then i'm going to turn it and spray the other side and like i always say i go with this spray paint sorry it has a lot of <laughs> um dirt from the cement anyway um it dries very fast that is an, a plus it does a great chrome finish like i always say tip two it dries really fast you just give it five minutes it's dry kabisa kabisa so guys firstly guys i think wow i think it turned out so gorgeous i love it i love how it looks i love the silver color i love the fold i love how it creates this pattern that just you know kind of wavers going up oh my god i love this guys i love that i didn't pick um it was by coincidence but i didn't pick a plain towel that just had like the the ruffles that it usually has this actually has patterns which just makes this a whole lot more beautiful so it has all these beautiful patterns on it and it just makes it look even better so i love that oh my god i love this so guys what i would advise is um after you, you when you're ready to spray paint or paint your base 
the best option to go with would be to actually just spray paint it because it easily gets um, in between the folds and you won't have any space looking like it was undone or something when you use the other paint it's gonna be a little harder and it will take a lot more time because you have to um, get smaller brushes and try to squeeze into all the spaces so you can always just choose to do this with you know spray paint spray paint is amazing and you can get it in a million colors and why do I love my silver spray paint first of all I love silver and that's the theme of my space and second of all it looks good it actually looks chrome so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i um, mean i will see you guys um next week inshallah with another video so you know stay tuned so you can get a lot more amazing diys coming your way and of course thank you so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this i hope you love this vase as much as i do i'm going to try and put flowers in here guys and show you real quick just to see what it looks like with flowers inside and this is what it looks like with the flowers inside i think it looks gorgeous honestly i love it i just love this whole um vase i love what it looks like i love how it turned out i think it looks amazing so yeah i'm just trying to get flowers to show this i feel like this is a vase that you can either choose to put um flowers in and you can also just choose to you know have it back it looks good either way so decided to try it with the red roses just to see what it looks like and it looks beautiful guys so you can try to do whatever color of flowers you want i think i'm going to be leaving mine bare for a while and then maybe after that i'll actually start putting flowers in it because it looks good either with the flowers without the flowers looks good i love how this looks Guys, over the past few weeks I have given you so many um, DIY ideas on flowers and how to just speak uh, how to make your own um, DIY pieces I hope you've got to learn something and you'll be able to have some of these pieces in your space as they will make it look really really aesthetic anyway guys thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you'll be able to make this simple beautiful DIYs for yourself if you can't don't forget you can always holler at me just um text me on instagram or in the comments below and tell me if you would like me to make this for you anyway um love you guys so much thank you so so much for watching subscribe for more um amazing videos and of course i'll see you guys next week inshallah bye bye